Hello friends, I will show you how to download Visual Studio 2019 today. Let's open the Google browser and write www.microsoft.com in search box. After enter the website, there is all Microsoft section on the menu. Let's click it. After that, we will click Visual Studio section. There are different three types packages of the Visual Studio. There are community, professional, and enterprise. Corporate company companies use the enterprise version. It is paid the professional version. Community version is free and we will use this version. Okay, let's download it and it will be downloaded an executable file and let's run the exe. I'm I am pressing to yes. After finishing the process, it will be redirect as a page, and which package are we are supposed to install here? It will ask us. Right now, I am on the work section, and it is being present to me. Okay, I'm selecting the asp.net desktop development. It's just me enough. I will be to develop Windows form application and console app but if you want to develop web application next time you have to select the asap.net web development or if you want to use python or c++ languages so you have to select this there is game development with unity here if you want to develop a game so you have to select this shortly visual studio can support this and visual studio is very big development environment you can use different languages and technologies no problem here now like i said just before it is just enough as asap.net desktop development it has 5 GB you can size bottom right of the page now i'm selecting second and i don't want to change here we can use default settings here i'm selecting a language package section what is language package sec friends sometimes you can want to use turkish or english or different languages in visual studio visual studio can support different languages I use it the Turkish language in Visual Studio, but now I will use English. I advise you to install two languages. You can change place of the installation. It will install it under C program files slash Visual Studio 2019 slash community. I won't change the location friends use the default one i don't know you realize if you select english the file is increasing file five 400 megabyte size friends okay that is all here let's press the install we will wait to install visual studio i think it will take a long time friends Visual Studio install it now, but we have to reboot the computer. Okay, my computer turn it on and let's open the Visual Studio together. Visual Studio 2019, I'm clicking. I will say you something here. When it open first, it may want to open an account in Visual Studio. We can open a, an Atmail account if you don't have it. Create an account, please. I logged in with my Hotmail account. Okay. After that, we have to select a template. I prefer light color all the time, but what you want, no problem. You can select, okay. Visual Studio open it now and 
We are waiting now. Okay. Let's get to the start. If you want to create a new project here, click new project. We will start first from console application and next lessons we will use Windows form application. We can find all to search here. First, we will start console app. So here, write console app. I'm writing here, and it is seeming Turkish language, but you can change your native language, no problem. After I open a new project, I'm gonna translate the English, no problem. We are supposed to do that. We have to choose the C# -sharp language one and console app.net framework. I'm clicking double friends and it will ask me the project name that I will create and once project location. If you want to create a folder, create it. After that, choose a target folder. You can store the projects that you created in target folder. We have to choose the .NET project version here. There are small differences between .NET versions, but it is not important. I advise you to use PanelMate's version in my opinion. For example, let's think you created a new project with 407 version. After that, if you want to open your project on different computers that have not for that seven version, it will occur a version error, unfortunately, friends. I faced this problem a lot. I advise you to use panel to made version. Let's enter a project name and press the create button. We are waiting now. Okay, friends. Right now, we opened a console project now and i will teach you of the visual studio interface next lesson please subscribe to my youtube channel see you next lesson take care of yourself have a good day